This is episode number 28 of my daily Minecraft video upload challenge. I have been continuously uploading Minecraft talking videos for the past 27 days straight and this is day number 28. Man, I talk about random topics, about different topics of life which I have experienced or several type of lessons which I have learned in this world on this series and I wanted to upload daily videos like every freaking day I get to my microphone, I switch on the my PC and all that and I just record and keep on going. I have talked about a lot of things like men, moms and uh, I, I cannot recall them because there are so many topics like 27 days aren't uh, you know a small number of days to completely summarize them in like one or two minutes but I have talked about a random number of things a lot of number of random things and today we are gonna talk about sugar or we can say that sugary drinks yeah man it's the one and all these sugary drinks soft drinks and you know sweet things which kind of make us feel better but they are gonna harm our body man sugar is one of the most thing most undesirable thing <laughs> which i we really detest a lot i mean yeah sugar it feels to it feels good to taste but do you know how much harm it does to our body see uh, carbohydrates are of two, two types complex carbohydrates and you know simple carbohydrates complex carbohydrates take uh, some time to get digested right and they are usually found in starch based foods like uh, wheat or potatoes especially those kind of things the simple carbohydrates which make us feel so much tasty and bitter and bitter and yummy not bitter it's better all right and yummy they are found in soft drinks or your cake or your cookies or your candies and all that usually right so i think you should at least try to know where the sweetness comes from right and i i would really like to draw your attention toward sugary drinks man i really hate them a lot although i also drink sugary drinks at some point in my life usually but I'm not a heavy drinker of sugary drinks. I drink about like one small can of like 400 ml or 200 ml in 20 days or 14 days. Like in two weeks, I eat one. I drink one can of soft drink. So I don't think it's that much, you know, uh, harmful. But still, man, it's not a good thing. You know, sometimes one sip, one sip of a soft drink can contain one teaspoon full of sugar. Imagine that amount of sugar going inside your body. It can make you ill very ill man seriously ill so try to avoid soft drinks soft drinks are made in such a way that they are gonna give you uh, <laughs> an extractive text sorry man i can't pronounce the word it is e c s t a t i c ecstatic ecstasy <laughs> this english word language is gonna <laughs> make me angry man so yeah they kind of make you feel so much nice at the cost of your health and they are not that much cheap like a coca cola a bottle of coca cola or a bottle of you know other sugary carbonated drinks are not that much cheap at least not in where i so yeah i think that you should try to avoid that and drink only when you haven't drunk that uh, sugary drink for a while like for a very long time and even then don't drink them in a one go like take a sip of them and wait for like five to ten minutes and then take another sip of them do not take drinks so a lot of soft drinks a lot of carbonate carbonated water or sugary drinks in one go it is really harmful to your kidneys to your body to your blood to your body glucose and all that you know it is a torture to for your body sugary drinks should be banned but man you know the capitalism how capitalism works and all that I would be having separate lectures on capitalism, socialism, communism, revolution and all that. You know, the world is our playground. The sky is the limit. I have so many topics to talk about that, you know, it would literally take like three or four years to even cover half of that. And I think that if I stuck around for that long, maybe people will get my message and all that. And maybe I think I need to improve my uh, audio and video a little bit more. I will be doing it. I'm not gonna throw in the towel and all that. 
that so yeah uh, actually i was addicted to sugary drinks a lot when i was younger today i am like between 25 to 30 years of age and i am not not that much addicted to sugary drinks but i was damn addicted to sugary drinks when i was younger like i would drink one complete bottle of coca cola in one go in one breath like i would drink one liter of coca cola in one drink in one breath if you can think of that right it's it was really really dangerous for me but i was younger somehow my body tolerated it but today i am kind of have gotten a little bit old so i don't think it will be so much easy on my body and it is gonna break my <laughs> break the neck so i so i'm still avoiding it and you know i have won this simple strange rule of mine that whenever i drink uh, some sugary drink i am gonna go for a run go for a walk or do something strenuous either mentally or physically because uh, you know our brain consumes 20 percent of the energy we uh, create uh, it's a uh, <laughs> it's a kind of uh, you know fascinating that our brain draws so much power from the body but yeah brain requires uh, a lot of energy to operate brain is not a simple thing it's a uh, it's literally an AI yeah, it's literally a supercomputer in some of things like uh, you can you can make uh, uh, a lot of you know expensive machines comp- complex machines but you can never imitate the workings of a human brain uh, I mean it's not possible at least for now so yeah brain draws a lot of power from your body to function normally and I have heard that it can be used to power up a 5 watt bulb although it's been a long time since I've read that please verify it on the internet if you know that up you know the total amount of iron content in an adult male's body can be converted into an iron nail yeah so there are so many fascinating things about human body I mean if you wanted to learn then you will definitely learn so yeah that's what I wanted to tell about that uh, you that sugary drinks must be avoided in Mexico and uh, Mexico some people call it <laughs> in Mexico uh, there was a recent surge of uh, diabetic patients uh, and in some regions it was attributed to the cheap availability of sugary drinks uh, like coca-cola and uh, other PepsiCo limited beverages and it's not a good thing man it's not I, I think the government are also in collusion with the companies I'm not blaming any government I have just heard it and all that so people should be really watchful about their health about their you know blood and kidneys because <laughs> you know man if you if your wealth is lost I mean nothing much is lost but if your health is lost a lot of things are lost man I mean one person the only person which understands the importance of health at the utmost level is the one which is currently in the hospital like if you are in the hospital you will just pray to God that please God please God save me from this mishap from this you know disease from this diabetes I will take care of myself from the next day alright so don't be in that desperate position man health is uh, something which should be taken uh, urgently and should be taken care of so please focus on your body focus on your mind and it's not nothing I mean don't give in to your impulses Uh, I mean I have heard that people uh, did something wrong people did something unreasonable unreasonable in insanity yeah I understand that but you know throwing in the towel uh, submitting yourself to your mind to your lust to your you know mental uh, desires and all that will only make it worse do not throw in the towel do not bend over the even inside you do not bend over the procrastination or laziness inside you do not do that just focus on yourself and man these evil kind of you know thoughts and natures uh, will come and go they just come and they will wait for a while waiting for you to get persuaded and if you are not gonna follow their orders uh, they will leave so evil thoughts come and go but you are you have to take care of not submitting to them before yourself all right i think we are hitting near the nine minute mark of daily video upload challenge and i think we are done for the moment we are episode number 28 i have got 20 i have got six subscribers only yeah <laughs> i have got six subscribers for 27 continuous upload videos so i think that i need to improve my quality and in the videos and i will look into it so yeah this is me signing off we will meet in the episode number 29 let's see what happens tomorrow bye